Good Monday morning. I'm meteorologist Casey Herman. I'll be filling in for Elizabeth Cope this week as she takes on the night role filling in for Brandon. So the big story this today starting off our Monday will be pretty much those winds out there. Winds will stay pretty consistent throughout the day gusting between 10 and 20 miles an hour. Some areas could even see gusts up to 30 miles an hour throughout the afternoon as well. Looking at 7 p.m. still seeing those 10 to 20 mile per hour gusts. Uh, 5 to 10 in Cut Bank, but then 10 to 20 once again by 11 p.m. this evening. Now, today's highs, we'll see those temperatures in the upper 40s and 50s here in central Montana, but Haver and Glasgow getting up a little bit warmer into the mid to upper 50s. Getting up to 51 in Cut Bank today, 55 in Jordan, 48 in the capital city, so a little bit chillier there. Future track, we are going to see continuance of showers today as we look at uh, the next coming hours. Possibly some of these showers will even make their way into central Montana. We are seeing here 11 a.m. some showers near the capital city. Most of these showers though best chance will be later on this afternoon and evening. We're going to see spotty showers continuing here throughout the later hours and into tonight. Now looking at tonight's forecast we are seeing mostly cloudy skies in Helena, Lewistown, and Great Falls, temperatures will be right around freezing, and some areas will be seeing those rain showers tonight. Now, looking at tomorrow's forecast, it's going to be shaping up to the best day of the week. Temperatures not too bad, 40s and 50s once again, but plenty of sunshine to go around in the state. And on Wednesday is when we're going to see those temperatures gradually cool down. Highs back into the 40s pretty much just about everywhere or the lower 50s. That's when we're going to see rain back into the forecast as well. Precipitation chances here for central Montana, obviously possible today. Dry on Tuesday, returning on Wednesday, and then continuing possibilities of rain and possibly even some snow continuing through the weekend.